everyone. Our ceremonies and our rituals keep us whole. In African societies and in many African descendant societies and among people of the earth who recognize the oneness of nature, ancestral homage is key to wholeness. We must honor those who have come before us, those whose names we know and those whose names we don't. For their energy brought us into this moment. And while we recognize the privilege and the responsibility of being in the moment, the present time is not a vacuum. We are a link in an eternal chain and our energy is, in this moment, creating the future. Past, present, and future are all now. Our responsibility therein is in the recreation and maintenance of order. And so I'm going to ask you if you'll just take this moment to breathe. As we release and get grounded, breathe. <sighs> Recognizing that God is the breath inside the breath as we breathe. <sighs> Some of us have photographs in our homes, names in a holy book, and the relics of our memory. Bring that vibration into this space. Bring their walk into our walk. Bring their commitment into our heads. Bring their love into our hearts as today we pour libation. if you could come down to the ground with me or if you cannot at least bend your backs over a little bit in the Yoruba language in the Yoruba language Tutu cool water on our tutu cool road, Ile Tutu cool earth. To call for the spirits of our ancestors, Moju Bobo we cool, Moju Bobo we cool, Moju Bobo we cool. Call out, call out, we cool. Jasper Young Bell, Ruth Price Bell, Janie Evelyn Harrison Price, James Little Price, Mariah Blair, Armistead Blair, Zanora Hope Bell, Willis Bell, Moji Bobo, we cool. Moji Bobo, we cool. Moji Bobo, we cool. Moji Bobo, we cool. Moju Bobo, we cool. we cool. We pay homage to our ancestors, those who are fortunate to be buried in the soils of Africa, the cradle of civilization. We pay homage to those who are the mothers and the fathers, who are the architects, the scientists, the educators, the agriculturalists, the mathematicians, the community builders, the spiritual leaders, the warriors. If you agree, we say Ashe. To those who were the natural caretakers of the earth's most precious minerals. Ashe. To those family groups and lines who lived interdependently, thereby creating and maintaining order. Ashe. 
and we pay homage to those who withstood the daily life-changing sacrifices made under European colonization and the transatlantic trade of enslaved Africans. Ashe. We pay homage to those who were lost in the Middle Passage. To those who could not endure the months at sea, objectified as cargo in horrifically inhumane conditions that disallowed cleanliness, warmth, nourishment, or love. We honor the water that is your eternal home. Ashe. Ashe. We pay homage to those whose bones rest in the earth in the Americas. Ashe. Ashe. We thank those who lived in the shackles of bondage and its legacy. Ashe. Ashe. We thank the thousands of Africans among the first in America who came through Richmond's notorious markets, bringing both the knowledge and strength of the motherland and despair. Ashe. Ashe. We thank those who were sold by Lumpkin, Omahandro, and Davenport, who still made life happen on nearby plantations inside Richmond or destinations down the river who have lived their lives so that we could have a different life. Ashe. Ashe. We pay homage to Solomon Northup, who was among the many to pass through Richmond's revolving doors, who before dark arrived in Richmond in what he called the chief city of Virginia. Ashe. Ashe. We remember our beloved ancestor who was mandated to Gooden's pen for an unfortunate night during his unfortunate journey. Ashe. Ashe. We remember all those who were subjected to Gooden's examination houses to determine their human value you inhumanely as if a horse. Ashe. Ashe. We pay homage to those whose un whose to those on whose unpaid backs the foundational success of the American economy was systematically built. Ashe. Ashe. Whose descendants, despite our advances, remain largely in exclusion as second class citizens. Ashe. Ashe. We pay homage to the first Africans to make their ancestral transition in Richmond in what has been reclaimed as Richmond's African burial ground. Ashe, Ashe. we thank the 3,000 black men, the USCTs, who claimed Richmond for the Union Army on April 3rd, 1865, effectively ending the Civil War and enslavement. Ashe. 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 We honor in memory those who rose through Reconstruction, the Black Codes, Jim Crow, Massive Resistance, the Civil Rights Movement, and the Black Power Movement. Ashe. Ashe. We honor in memory their clarity. Freedom fighters all. Ashe. Ashe. Burn with the need for social justice and empowerment. Ashe. Ashe. We are because you were. It is upon your broad shoulders that we stand, for you have tried the path to make our way clearer. We ask for your continued blessings. Ashe. 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 And we remember our elders, our parents, our teachers, at whose feet we are blessed to sit to absorb your wisdom. We ask for your continued guidance and protection. Ashe. Ashe. And for our children. For it is through you who we will live our future. We ask for your continued vision and vitality. Ashe. Ashe. May these cool waters and spirits quench the souls of our ancestors, nourish the spirits of our children, and make clear the power of this moment. Ashe. Ashe. Be the will of God. As it was said, so it shall be. Ashe.